If you need to lengthen or splice auger, position your joint as close to the power unit as possible to minimize any restriction of feed flow in the line. Wear the appropriate personal protective equipment and use a grinder to clean the edges of the two pieces. Using an angle iron tray as a guide, butt the outside edges of the auger together to braise them. Overlap distance will be anywhere from 1 to 1 and 3 quarters inches depending on the model of the auger line. Butt the outer edges of the auger together. Never interloop the edges. Interlooping the edges will only serve to restrict feed flow. Once properly butted together, securely clamp the auger pieces to the tray. A bronze flux coated rod is recommended for brazing. Start by heating the metal auger with a torch, then introduce the rod, placing it directly into the flame. Make certain the joint is well filled and smooth so that it does not wear against the feed tube. Once the inside edge has been brazed, unclamp the auger, rotate it, and continue brazing the outer edge in the same manner. Allow the joint to cool, then file off any rough edges or brazing that extend beyond the outside radius of the auger fittings.